Hello and welcome to the channel. My name is Vijay and I am a Microsoft MVP specialized in SharePoint. In this video, we are going to see how we can reset password of an Office 365 user in Office um, in our tenant as well as I will show you how we can reset password for multiple users in the same Office 365 tenant. In my previous videos, I have explained how we can sign up for an Office 365 tenant, which is a Office 365 Enterprise E5 tenant. And also, I have explained how we can add single user as well as how we can uh, create multiple users in the Office 365 tenant. Now, let me open my browser. Okay, so meanwhile, if you want to learn SharePoint, I have a training course which you can check out. These are uh, various training courses for our developers as well as for the site owners. You can have a look at it and if you are interested, then you, I will, you will find some useful coupon codes in the comment section of the video which you can try. Now let me open my Office 365 Admin Center. So I will open admin.microsoft.com which will ultimately open your Microsoft 365 Admin Center. If you have not logged in, then it will ask you to enter your Office 365 credentials. So you can put your Office 365 username and password, but make sure that you are a tenant administrator for this or you should be a member of the tenant admin group. Now I will click on this user and I'll go to the active users. So if you will see here in our last video, I have explained how we can add multiple users and based on that we have added uh, five more users into the tenant. Now what you can do is let's say I want to uh, reset the password for Ben then you can see here there is a button which is saying reset password. If you just hover it it will come click on that and then you can see here it is asking you that if you want to auto generate the password or if you want to create the password manually and then if you want to uh, if you want user to change the password when they first time sign in so you can do this here the other way what you can do is the moment you will select a particular user you can see here there is a reset button which is enabling and if you click on that you will come up with the same screen apart from that so these are the individual user whatever i said apart from that uh, you can also select multiple users from here and the same reset button will come here and you can same way you can auto generate or create the password apart from that if you'll without selecting anything if you'll just click on this triple dot you can see here there's a reset button a reset password is coming so the moment you click on that it will come up with a new screen where you will see all your users as well as you have the option where you can select an user also. So suppose I will say, let's say CY. So it will show me the user who is starting from CY. Now I want to uh, update password for multiple users. So I'll select this user. So these are the users that I have added before. So you can see here, I selected these five users. I'll click on select. And then it is saying that if you want to create the password or if you want to auto generate it, I will say let me create the password and I don't want people to change the password because this is as a developer tenant I'm using so I don't want every time I log in or first time when we are doing I because ultimately I am using the system but if you are using uh, of you if you want all your users are using then surely you can check this option so that when they will sign in they can change the password now I'll give a password so make sure to give a strong password over here which will having uh, uh, a combination of letter lowercase uppercase and the numbers and then click on reset so the moment you will say click on reset it will take some time and then it will reset all the users password whichever you have selected here so you can see here now it is showing all the users and the password as well and if you we'll click on show it will show all the uh, passwords also now if you want to send the uh, uh, password in the email you can see here uh, you can actually email the new password also to the users or if you can put whatever the email address here you can put the email addresses and you can say send and uh, send email and close so the moment you will say then it will actually send the email and all the password of those users has been changed and an email will be sent to the username which we have provided in this case my username and you can see here I got uh, one email over here. 
so this is how you can see here uh, in this particular case I, I i'll just open my email you can see and it is showing me all the username passwords as well so this is how we can change or we can reset password of uh, various users in office 365 now if you really like our uh, video subscribe to our youtube channel and you will get a lot of free videos on SharePoint, Power BI, Power Apps, SPFX, all these uh, latest Microsoft technologies, Office 365, Azure videos also you are going to get. And these are our Twitter handles, so you can follow us in the Twitter. And this is the LinkedIn and our Facebook pages. So uh, subscribe to our YouTube channel, comments and share and have a nice day.